hey you guys good morning so this is the start of a vacation preparation vlog if you're new here my name is Yvette welcome 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 um so I am going on vacation soon I'll get into more into that on the next video but I'm going on vacation and I am now starting to prepare for you know doing the girly things the stuff that I wish I didn't have to do I wish I could just go get a haircut and that's it but I can't so um, I, my, I'm looking real raggedy right now because I am going to get some I guess they're called like butterfly locks I don't pretty much full locks but you know there's different type of ones so I actually got them before um when I went into labor yeah so I'm actually getting color you guys I'm actually quite nervous okay I'm quite oh look at that sun on my skin though <laughs> but um okay so today we're getting my hair done I had to wash my hair so it could be free from any product so I did that this morning and I'm just drinking my coffee I honestly want to stop at Starbucks but I don't know if I'm going to have time I'm supposed to be there at nine o'clock and what time it is 8 32 i might have time i gotta stop anyway and get cash because you know they don't be liking for you to pay via cash app or whatever so i have to get cash and so let me tell y'all everything that i'm getting done i'm getting my hair done next i am getting my nails done then i'm getting done my feet done my lashes and a wax so that's everything that I'm got so that's what I'm on my way to now you guys every time I record my every time I edit my videos I'll be like I hate the way that my seat look in the back I've had this car since 2011 you guys well 2012 it's a 2011 car and it's like one thing I have always hated about the seats is no matter what spill on the seats, like it could be even water, it always dries with a water spike up. You can see the stains from what spilled there. And you know, my kids be back there. I don't be back there. So my kids be back there and you know, you know how that go if you have kids. But anyway, that's what we're about to do, you guys. And I think I'm gonna stop at Starbucks because I really want to get something to eat. She said it takes about eight hours. Oh, also, let me say, y'all, I am going to try to get as much footage as I can with everything that I have to get done. I'm getting a little more comfortable with asking people, like, are you okay if I vlog and stuff like that? But I've never met this girl. I don't know the environment. If it's in her house, you know, she might not want me filming. You know what I'm saying? Like, her environment, I don't know. I don't be knowing if people don't want you to film because they don't want people to see the technique. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. So, I'm going to ask and I'm going to just be like, you know, if you're not okay with me filming, you know, that's completely fine. I just, you know, want to ask. So, I'm going to ask and I'm going to just be like, you know, if you don't want me to film, you know, please don't say yes just so you don't want to hurt my feelings. I'm completely fine, okay? Because I don't like when people take pictures of me off guard because I be like, do I look fat? Listen, let me see the angles, okay? Got my food. I actually went to Wendy's because I was like, why am I going to Starbucks? And usually I would get like a Frappuccino and a blueberry muffin or whatever, but I already had coffee. So I was like, let me just go to Wendy's. So I really like Wendy's um, breakfast. I know it's probably not healthy for you, but it's a lot of things not healthy for you. So anyway. I really like their seasoned fries, you guys. It is so good. And then I got, I got a number one. I don't even know what it's called, but I just know it got bacon and it's like a maple biscuit. Mm. <laughs> and I got a water for the drink. So now I have to go to the ATM and get some money out. Y'all, I am tired of paying for stuff to get. Listen, I'll be so happy when I get to the point in life where I don't have to worry about, you always gonna have bills. I wanna get to the point where I'm financially free to where I don't have to worry about the cost of things. Like, I already, 
already know how much this is going to cost so it's not really like something that's like hurting me because i already was prepared for it but you know like i want to get to the point where i ain't even got to check my bank account like oh the hair costs 400 dollars. that's the, what okay 400 dollars. what is that <laughs> you know what i'm saying what is that All right, y'all. So I'm about to go to my appointment. I need my phone for my GPS. So let's get it started. Wish me luck. I'm gonna have to get used to it y'all because like I do color like with my wigs and stuff but it always like I would say it's always mainly um a, a natural color so like it'll have like streaks or highlights of like blonde or something like that I never really did like where majority of my hair is color but I like it and I feel like once I put makeup on it's gonna look even better and I feel like that it's just, I don't know. I feel like that it's, it's, just, it's, it's just, it's just, it's a vibe. So I like it. She was a really nice girl and she did not mind me, um, well, nice woman. And she did not mind me filming. So I always appreciate that. Right now I'm trying to figure out how to get out though. So I just wanted to show you all my hair. I am gonna, of course, as the week go on and I prepare, for my vacay i'm gonna do my makeup so y'all can see you know the full effect because you know sometimes i hear so a hair don't give a full effect until you just you get put that makeup on you look cute and all that right so hair is done all right y'all so it is now friday july the 2nd and i'm on my way to get my eyebrows done i do have um the twins in the back and elijah back there with them and um, yeah, so today is just eyebrows. I get my eyebrows threaded. I ain't never recorded, so yeah. <laughs> I was supposed to get my um, what in the world? Left two lanes block past independence. 
What time? Mm, I ain't even got my watch on. Anyway, um, I hate getting it threaded, y'all. Like, it, I just do not like it. And, and you know, I'm my lady friend here. So, when she here, it's like, it hurts worse. So, it's like I'm more sensitive. So, yeah. But anyway, my hair is holding up good, y'all. I have not did my edges at all. I just like whatever, you know, my scarf. When I have my scarf on, it kind of naturally, like, pulls my baby hair down. So, I um I haven't put any, like, edge control on my edges yet because I just feel like it builds up and it, like, just makes it look old. So, I'm going to wait until it gets a little, you know, closer to where we are actually about to leave. But, yeah. So, Get oh, another thing I want to, well, y'all see, I barely have any eyebrows for real, for real, y'all. I barely got any, but I she, I like how she do it because she make it look like I have some. It, it makes me look, I don't know. I just like, I, I just like how she do it. I like getting it threaded. I just, I like it. Because mm -hmm. so, she try to make it as, as thick as possible. Oh, it's an accident. No, I ain't lying. I ain't hiding. I've been grinding, multiplying. I've been trying to get my weight up, staying prayed up, meditating and taking time away. You always posting up pictures, trying to look like you're winning. I'm writing rhymes in the kitchen, soaking in moments we live in. Yeah, you got the nerve to be on me. Faking your life for the IG If you got my number, don't add me Cause baby, I'm on hiatus I'm on hiatus I'm on hiatus mm -hmm. I'm on hiatus uh -huh. Baby, don't check for me Taking time out to be she do it and I get my eyebrows I, I, I do not normally get my eyebrows done like routinely I can being that I don't have a lot of eyebrows I can kind of grow it out y'all my phone keep falling hold on let me take my charge off um being that I don't have like a lot of eyebrows I can kind of like go a little longer with getting them filled in um but um yeah, so I got my eyebrows done. I like the way she does it because when I go to fill it in, fill them in, it's not hard. And that's really the main thing. Like I fill in my eyebrows. So it's kind of like, if, if you don't have like really a shape to it, it's kind of harder to fill them in. So I got my eyebrows done so I won't have to struggle with filling them in. And now I'm about to go get my feet done. Now y'all, my feet looks horrendous. Will y'all see my feet? When y'all see my feet, <laughs> I know somebody go listen. My feet. I usually keep my okay. I keep my toes done in the summertime. Not really in the winter time, like routinely as I should. But I do keep my feet done in the summertime. However, I've been putting off getting them done because I knew that I was having a trip come up, and I've been kind of like really busy. But, um, you know, I've been kind of putting it off to when my trip, because I'm like, mm, I got a trip coming up. But I don't know, depending on how I feel when I get there, you got, 
depending on how I feel when I get there determines whether or not I'm gonna let them actually do a pedicure because I only get gel I don't get anything other than gel on my toes if you do not get gel on your toes what are you doing girl what is you doing because for one I ain't got time to sit there and wait for them to dry and for two even when you be thinking they dry they really don't be dry and for three gel lasts longer so it's like gel is the wave okay like if you get in regular polish I'm gonna need for you to stop stop what you're doing and get gel okay so i get gel which that's already 20 dollars off back then the pedicure that i get it is 45 i get like a jelly pedicure so that's 45 so i always end up paying with tip like 70 something dollars oh i do get a tip well 10 percent ain't nothing but tax i get a 10 percent discount for my birthday but yeah so that's what i'm on my way to i did make an appointment only for a toenail polish change but i don't know how i'm gonna feel when i get there my sister is going with me but she's actually getting her nails done so i know that i'm gonna have to end up wait anyway because like the toenail polish change that's nothing but what i was gonna do was i actually have like the reason why i don't really want to get a full pedicure is because I just feel like it's like sometimes it's a waste of money honestly I like how it feels it makes me it is very relaxing but I just don't feel like doing it today and I like when they scrape the bottom of my feet however I feel like that like I just don't feel like that last like it just be right back feeling how I normally feel a couple of days later and I already have at home like the foot scraper I have the foot scraper I have a foot scrub and I have a foot um like cream that I got from Bath and Body Works so I was like I could do this myself because when you go in there they don't allow you to just get just the like the bottom of your feet scraped which I don't know why like let me just just scrape the dead skin hey that's all I want but they don't allow you to do that she claimed that they can't do it without doing the whole pedicure or whatever so yeah so that's where i'm at today i don't know how i'm gonna feel now i do want to let me tell y'all let me let me tell y'all about my man how he played me i want to get a french like I, I never got french tips on my um a french tip design on my toes i wanted to get that because i feel like it's a more classier look however my toes are not like a pure like like you see like how you you know like it's like pink that's not how my toenails look i don't know why they always been kind of some of them been kind of like darker than what they normally is i really think that i got it from um like hereditary so he was like i said babe do you think that i should just get like uh fresh tip or should i get like all like all white he was like get all white because i don't want no brown and white toenails you guys this is how my feet i end up getting a fresh tip y'all i don't know it's something new, but
nails so now i only have two more appointments that i have to get like as far as uh preparing for vacation which is my bikini wax and my lashes i'm on my way to my bikini wax now y'all i hate getting a wax i hate it okay i hate it i love the aftermath y'all i don't know about nobody else but i just i Listen, I'll be having to put my seatbelt behind me. I feel like I'm restricted. Like, I mean, that is the point, but I just, I don't know. But, anyway, yes, I'm going to get a bikini wax. Now, what I was saying was, yesterday my phone went dead, which I'm mad about because I really wanted you all to see, like, the part when she actually did, like, the actual design. But my dad gonna phone went dead, so for now, and then when I got in the car, I realized I had my dad gonna charge it in my purse. So I really hate when that happened, you guys, because I'm just like really like particular, which I try not to be so particular when it comes to my videos because everything is not gonna be perfect. But I hate when something doesn't go as planned, and I hate when I can't get the content that I really want to get. So, but it's neither it's neither here nor there. Um. But yeah, so I get my lashes done later on today though. And then that will be it. So I did my uh, I did my feet, my nails, my eyebrows, and my hair. So yeah, now the only thing left is a bikini wax and my lashes. And then I'm done. I'm ready for this process to be over in T-Way because it's just too much. Like it's just too much. But of course with the bikini wax, you can't actually watch me get a bikini wax for obvious reasons so i get a little footage y'all after i literally just said i'm i i'll be mad when i can't get the content i want i go in there set my camera up and everything and didn't even press record see this is the stuff that makes me mad because it's like even what are you doing but you know what it's okay. Well, I'm gonna tell myself that it's okay because y'all couldn't see anything anyway. Like y'all couldn't actually see the service. Y'all would just see my face, and then you really couldn't even see my facial expressions because my mask. So y'all won't missing out on nothing for real. But that's over with. Thank the Lord, because I hate getting waxes for real. I really do. Like I love them, but I hate them. I wish you could just be one. You know what? You know what they should come out with? They should come out with something where you could put like the whole wax down there 
and just rip it off. Then you ain't gotta keep getting strips. That's what it should be. Cause that jane. Mm -mm. But anyway, so at 12:30 I have to go get a COVID test. I am not going to be able to record that because it's not like drive-through. If it was drive-through, then I would be okay with recording it. But I actually have to go into CVS and like go into like a little clinic or whatever. And well, I don't know. I might. I I don't know. It depends on the vibes. So I might do that. But um, then my lashes. So yeah. I'll see y'all later on when it's around that time. I'm about to go home and pack and then start another video. So. COVID testing time. Oh shit, I'll be tripping. <laughs> Put it back in here? Yeah, go ahead. And then uh, just take this thermometer and point and click on your forehead. <clears throat> 97 9. Okay, thank you. You're going to get a phone call, email, and text um, by 7 o'clock. Okay? okay, thank Have you. but I did not show you all my lashes. This is my first time doing my makeup with it with them on. So I really like them much better with the makeup because at first I was like, honey, this is a little bit too much for me. But that is it for my vacay preparation, you guys. So I did my hair, nails, feet, um, eyebrows, and my lashes. I think I got it all. So I hope you all enjoyed this preparation vlog. Thank you for um, watching this vlog. I hope you all guys enjoyed it. Bye.